Master Sima Yi, I understand that Wang Ling has instigated a rebellion. I will do anything that you ask, but I beg of you to please spare the life of my wife. Please. <coughs> Guo Huai, I have no reason to doubt your loyalty. I shall see that your wife is looked after. Oh, you are so merciful, my lord. If you will excuse me. Guo Huai looked even paler than usual today. His wife is Wang Ling's younger sister. It is only natural that he worry about her safety due to the crimes of her family. Even so. Zhao, this is not an issue to deal with emotionally. Whether Guo Huai's wife lives or dies is entirely up to him. Father, preparations to eliminate Wang Ling are complete. Zhao, tell Guo Huai to hurry to his post. Sure, I'll do that. This is no time to be squabbling amongst ourselves. We must slay the traitor Wang Ling with all haste! Not afford to lose this position. I shall personally see to its defense. Let's go. Now is the time to attack. I can't let the Wu army take this base. We have to remember what will be waiting for me if I fail. Our hands been forced now that the enemy's reinforcements are here. Take down the castle while we still have time. Okay, it's time to bring out the siege weapons. Let's tear down these gates and bring an end to this battle. The mind shall vanquish the soul. Ha, that was too easy. <laughs> you are unstoppable. Nice to see you doing so well. Let's go! Now is the time to attack! Should I really stay and follow Master Wang Ni? I don't know what decision to make. Wang Hua, what are you waiting for? You do not want to be on the wrong side of the Sima clan. Remarkable strength. It is simply impossible to go up against the Sima clan. Can I be defeated before we take the castle? What a failure I am. Father, you are a true warrior of the Three Kingdoms. I wasn't part of this rebellion! I wanted to fight for you, Master Sima! Yes. We march on Shushun to kill the rebel Wang Ling! I understand Master Wang Lin's son, Wang Guang, is around here. 
He is not involved in the rebellion and is in hiding. If I can find him, maybe I can get him to talk to Master Wan Lin and convince him to stop this madness. Ha! Huh. That was too oh. easy. <laughs> You are shining brightly as a result of your efforts out there. We converted them to our side, just as I planned. They will serve as excellent pawns in our attack on Shushu. I think I've seen who you are looking for. Over there, actually. I saw them a ways in that direction. I'm sure it's who you're looking for. shall vanquish the soul. What? You aren't here to kill me. Persuade my father. Well, I'll try. Hey, get on in here. <laughs> perfect, just perfect. Everyone, to defend this area. The Sima clan toys with our kingdom like it is their plaything. They must be slain. I will commit everything I have to that goal. Oh. <sighs> Master Wang Ling's plan could never work. I will side with the Sima clan. Open the gates. What? We have been betrayed? This is a disaster! Father, stop this rebellion! Do you really think you can complete it alone? One Gwen. I'm sorry for the inconvenience I have caused, but I'm afraid this is it for me. This is as far as my strength will take me, but there are more like me who do not agree with your methods. The rebellion has been suppressed, but this victory is a hollow one. It feels like we're just gouging out our own flesh. 
Master Wan Lin's family will be executed for this treachery. I only hope somehow my wife will be spared. Father, the rebellion has been suppressed. Are we to follow standard protocols in the punishment of the families of the rebels? Unless you have any objections. Mr. Simae! Please, I beg you! I know, Guo Huai. Xi, I need to speak to you in regards to dealing with the chaos. Master Sima E, thank you so much. Father. Sima E brilliantly suppressed the rebellion led by Wan Ling. As a result, his power and influence rose immensely. It was thought that Sima E would soon make a play for control of Wei. Sima E could not help but be amused by such rumors. He had been discovered by Cao Cao and contributed to victory in numerous battles. He also served Cao Pi as he repelled countless threats from outside enemies. And, following their deaths, he eliminated any imbeciles in Wei that might challenge him. In that sense, he was playing the role of the usurper. Sima Yi was keenly aware of both the lack of support felt by the people, as well as the danger of a country without a successor. Father! What is it? Uh, uh, it's been a while since I saw you do that. Uh, we're sorry to stop you like that. Hmm. It seems you did not inherit this particular trick of mine. So what is it? With both of you here, I assume you aren't just talking about the weather. We're here to tell you that the Imperial family has been moved to Ye. Now those who seek to remove you will surely not find it so easy to get to them. <laughs> Father? No. I am just amazed at Lord Cao Cao's foresight. He was always a bit wary of this ability of mine. Lord Cao Cao, when I had secluded myself from the world, saw my talent and gave me a central role in Wei. He weighed the dangers of my ambition against my ability, and in the end chose my ability. At the time, so long ago, I could never really make sense of that. I mean, it never even crossed my mind to betray him. I would never have thought of that. Father. And yet, Look at what we are doing right now. Who holds true power in the palace now? I see what you mean. If you put it like that, I understand. Lord Cao Cao left behind an able successor in Lord P. His only miscalculation was that Lord P died so young. Hmm. Listen to me, you two. You must raise many worthy successors, so that after I'm gone, the world is not left to a bunch of fools. Yes. Yes, Father. <laughs>